computer science videos here today to show you guys in this tutorial how to view your daily motion analytics on a Mac computer without further ado let us start the video so in this tutorial you need to have access to a Mac computer have access to an account for daily motion have uploaded videos to your daily motion account so we can then look at all the analytics and see what's really happening we can now start this tutorial before I start this tutorial, I would like to say that you are more than welcome to subscribe to my channel, Computer Science Videos. As we know, every problem is solved by indirection. You can also follow my Twitter account. We are trying to grow as fast as ever. I'm on TikTok. We post videos here and there. Follow my page on Facebook. I'm also on Instagram. You are more than welcome to support me on PayPal. Let's now focus on the video. So let's now go over to the dock. Go to the web browser, which is Safari in this case. Now go to dailymotion.com. Use the shortcut within the bookmarks. Click on daily motion. This will take me to my daily motion account. Go to the top right corner. Click on settings. Go to partner HQ. And as you can see, we have videos uploaded to the account. 16 videos across the last couple of days so that should give us enough material to now have some data that can be used to look at what is really happening so if I now go to the left hand side navigation menu click on analytics go to overview we can filter all channels as we have one channel let's just keep it on computer science videos we can look at the views total time watched the view through rate estimated earnings if there is any you would have to be a partner to have that feature enabled on your account how many uploads you may have there's definitely some problems here because i can assure you that i have uploaded 16 videos but i'm not really too sure why it's coming up as 26 first they uploaded one then we uploaded a total of let's say six or seven and then it came to 13 and then we uploaded three but what's happened here is one plus nine is 10 plus 13 comes to 23 plus three which is 26 but it's really 16 so if we go down we have the top channels if I now click on views this then gives us top videos the owner tags countries that the videos are being viewed in top domains traffic sources playlist data channels devices players pages and actions what's really happening go to time watched view through rate and we would then be given more statistical data if i go back to media videos go back to overview scroll down and then we have the data available let's now go to filters and we can use filters if we require to select an item within the top dimensions to filter the dashboard let's click on let's just say my content and that filters everything to content we can use last 30 days last three or 12 months this year last year And so that's all you need to know about your daily motion analytics what is really happening where the content is being viewed from is it on a mobile phone is it on a computer so we can now quit safari and so that's it for this video i'll see you guys in my next tutorial thanks for now Thank you for making it towards the end of the video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, Computer Science Videos. Be sure to check out the previous video on screen now, or you can ideally click on the playlist and watch all the journey for Computer Science Videos from the start until now.